Have you got any questions for me? Yeah, this I actually do. You know, see, let's switch it up a bit. Yeah, I actually have a few questions. What's this it? Cool. What's it like being a father? It's difficult because it's full time, not like a full time employment, full time where you're you know, you're there like for eight to twelve hours. It's like when you're sleeping, you might get woken up for like something, you know. Yeah. And you always have to constantly think, are they still breathing? You know, <laughs> <laughs> that's true. So it's like exhausting. You know, like a lot of people, they always say, oh, it's the best day of my life. You know, like, oh, these kids <laughs> is like, but then I think that's not the whole truth. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know? And yeah. once you become a parent, you, I think it must, I think a lot of parents must think the same thing. It's like, it's like a secret, you know? Yeah. It's like the secret that parents have is like, it's not that easy. It's not that easy, hey. <laughs> you know? Yeah, it's not People easy. just want to put out the, oh, man, like the best day of my life, you know? I mean, it is, right? But there's other things like, that happen. Like there are times where you have enjoyment, you know, and you're overwhelmed and because of this person that you're raising and you brought in. But like for the most part, it's just a lot of stuff that you – would rather not be doing, you know? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's the truth, you know? You don't want to be wiping up some, like, messy, like, nappies, you know? Well, it's only for a while. And not just once, off. you know? It's not just once. <laughs> so, did you, how did you but feel? But that's one example, you know? <laughs> one example is, like, there are some things that you have to do. <laughs> You know, not necessarily some things that you like enjoy, but then it just compounds because it's like so many of these things, you know, then you got to think of the children's, um, mm. you know, obviously the health, their diet, what are they eating? And then sometimes you struggle giving them what they need versus what they want, you know, and then teaching them values, especially if, you know, children, they don't retain information like that easily so you have to co like constantly mm. try to teach lessons and remind and you know it has to make sense to them too you know i think a lot of parents try to teach where they don't understand themselves yeah. and i think there's yeah a whole mm. bunch of these things that make it difficult and exhausting wow yeah <laughs> Do you think you're going to have any morals to um, to the the limit? Like two is exhausting. So thinking <laughs> so of three, probably three is going to be <laughs> out of the question. Yeah, it's like a lot of dynamics. You know, a lot of things you have to consider, like your own personal position in life. You know, financially, mm. mentally, physically. Like, for example, if we were like billionaires, oh and yeah. And in our youth, we just went to sports and we kept, you know, like physically fit and kept like health checks up. And so our health is like perfect or like immaculate and like financial backing. We'll probably have like 20 kids, you know. Wow. <laughs> no, that's my thinking. Probably not because it takes two, you know. <laughs> and how does Kate feel about <laughs> Well, you have to ask Kate, you know. Interesting. Mm. Are you thinking about children or yes that, well that's that's why, a personal question yeah no that's why i was asking because yeah we are planning to yeah. all the best you yeah know. hopefully next year yeah, yeah yeah at the same time i'm blessed in that regards because i i appreciate i understand that not everyone gets to become a father or mm. a mother you know and so i don't want to um not show my appreciation in that regards, but it is difficult and for a reason, you know. Yeah, but worth it. Worth it, yeah. yeah. At the end of all At of it, it's of worth it. it. Yeah. yeah, you'll see. <laughs> yeah, but it's like the first, I think, three to four years is the most difficult because mm. I, I find with my daughter, it's. It's a lot more enjoyable now. Yeah. You know, wonderful. because she can talk, she can walk, she can do a lot of independent stuff. Yeah. You know? And I like to travel, so I always um I'm always thinking like, oh, you know, 
would it be right to travel? And I know with her, like we can. Yeah. Like if it was just me, her, maybe Kate, <laughs> <laughs> we could travel, you know, yeah. and it'll be wouldn't be so stressful. Yeah. But with my son, he's still technically two. You know, he's turning three, so like probably not the best time to travel with him. Yeah, maybe a few more years. Yeah.